Hey guys, Jason from U-Haul, and today I'm gonna to show you how to load your side-by-side -side onto this U-Haul Auto Transport. Before we get started, let's go ahead and take a look at the Auto Transport, look at the dimensions, and then also, we'll take some time and look at our RZR here, figure out what our width is and our length, just to make sure it fits on the Auto Transport. Let's get started. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take a look at our minimum width and our maximum width of the trailer. To start with, we know our maximum width is 79 inches. We also know that our minimum width is 41 inches. Now, let's take a look at our maximum length. So we're at 148 inches. Now, let's go ahead and take a look at our side-by-side -side and get our measurements. The outside track width is about 65 inches. Our inside track width is about 47 inches. Let's go ahead and measure the rear. We should never assume that both the front and the rear are gonna have the same measurements. The outside track width is about 65 inches. Our inside track width, we're about 44. Let's go ahead and get a measurement of our wheelbase. So we're gonna measure center to center, right about 90 inches. So now that we know our dimensions, let's go ahead and move on to another important subject, weight. All right, so we determined our towing vehicle has a 5,000 pound hitch rating. Let's go ahead and do a quick internet search to figure out how much our side-by-side -side weighs. Always make sure you are searching for your exact model ATV as weights vary between vehicle brands and manufacturers. It looks like the average weight of our Polaris RZR is 1,235 pounds. And our U-Haul Auto Transport empty trailer weight is 2,190 pounds. A quick recap. The combined weight of our ATV and transport is 3,425 pounds and our towing system capacity is 5,000 pounds. Now that we decided fitability, we now need to make sure that we load heavier on the front. You're always going to want 60% of your load in the front, 40% in the rear. In this particular case, this side-by-side, -side, the engine is located in the rear. So we're going to go ahead and back it up onto our U-Haul Auto Transport. But first, let's go ahead and set the park brake on the truck and get it loaded. All right, we have our trailer prepped. We have the ramps out. All I'm gonna need to do now is grab somebody to give me a hand. The most important part here, it's crucial to take it slow and make sure you never stand in front of the trailer while loading it. Let's get started. Let's go ahead and strap down the tires. You're gonna to wanna to center the tire strap around the tire. Then center your ratchet spool to the center of the tire and then insert your strap into the ratchet spool. Now let's go ahead and repeat the same steps on the other side. All right, now that we have our tire straps secured, let's go ahead and install our security chain. You're gonna to wanna to go ahead and find a safe point. On this one, we have a D-ring on the back of the side-by-side. -side. All right, let's go to the rear. Let's go ahead and attach our rear security chain. We're gonna go ahead and put it on the lower A-arm. All right, we have our side-by-side -side secured onto our U-Haul Auto Transport. We're ready to hit the trails. All we need to do at this point, in about five miles, you're gonna wanna pull over. Make sure your straps are still secured, everything's still in place, and you're ready to go. 
have a safe trip. If you need any more information on this trailer or any of our products, please feel free to visit us at uhaul.com.